two, one. Hi, it's Heather again from Tel Labs here at Supercom 2009 with John. John, if you had a magic wand and you could get your network to do one thing, what would it be? Probably transmit as many high definition pictures at one time as I could. So you'd need a lot of bandwidth? A lot of bandwidth for that. Do you think any network today could handle the amount of pictures that you would like to upload? I'm certain there are networks out there that are up to that challenge today, or soon will be. So what do you think service providers need to do to get to that point? Probably invest in upgraded network equipment. Uh, there's probably enough fiber in the ground already to accommodate that. So it's usually to get more bandwidth, you need to upgrade the terminal equipment, not so much like the fiber. So you've been at Supercom for a couple hours. Do you see any providers that are standing out in that area? Anybody that really is making progress? Uh, no one that I've seen so far, but yeah, I'm certain there's people out here that have got equipment will do that. The thing that I see a lot of this year is Ethernet products, and of course, that's got a lot wider bandwidth than your T1, so uh, that's where everything seems to be headed right now. What's the most interesting Ethernet trend that you see? Uh, probably bigger pipes, wider bandwidth, because you're going to be doing a lot more video conferencing as far as businesses go, uh, so you're going to be transmitting a lot more video just on a day-to-day -day basis for video conferencing and just run-of-the-mill business applications. So what's the most interesting thing you've seen so far today? Uh, I'm the geeky one that likes all the equipment, so... I think the most interesting thing is the trend towards more Ethernet equipment and uh, ways to transport that type of signal over fiber, copper, radio, that type of thing. Okay. Well, thank you very much for taking the